206. Okay. Mm. And you? Look up. 187. No! <laughs> okay. Hello, people. Hello, people. <laughs> so, we are back with another vloggy vlog. Yeah. But one that I'm sure you guys were anticipating. Waiting. <laughs> yeah. But uh, before we get into it, we have to give congratulations to ourselves. Yeah. You know, <laughs> for um, accomplishing what we set out to do, exactly. which was seven days cabbage and potatoes. Right. Well, it was more <laughs> like a trial for us. It was. And um, trial turns into a success. Because we we thought that if it's a success, if we lose weight, then toward more towards our holiday, say a few weeks before, we would do it again. Right. Kind of like yeah. cheating. <laughs> But we're going to be exercising no. in between. When I say kind of like cheating, it's like, <laughs> um, so you can munch in anything that you would really want to munch in yeah. throughout the, um, the, the months, yeah. right? And then as it nears, when you really <laughs> want to show off that beach body, <laughs> yeah, it, it is, a, it is a, an idea. Yeah. I, while we were doing it, I kind of like analyzed the diet and mm. realized that it is actually a a crash diet. It is, yeah. And it's actually a liquid diet disguised as food. Right. You know, but before we get into all the right, <laughs> I'm gonna let you guys see the food that we ate over yeah. the last see our journey. Seven days. Yeah. Check it out. <laughs> this is day one's first meal of our seven day cabbage and potato diet. Yes. So, on the chopping board, we've got there four or five potatoes chopped up. Yes. Some celery, some purple onion, <laughs> some normal onions, some garlic, and some bouillon. And we're going to put them in that pot of water. Add a little bit of salt, maybe pepper, pepper a little bit of seasoning. And that's gonna be pretty much it. Yep. That's gonna be um, a meal. Hopefully, we can have two portions out of that. Yeah, we'll be good to go. Too. Day two. This is pretty much what's gonna be today's meal. I've got about fifteen average size potatoes, an onion, and a cabbage. I might not use all this cabbage. The whole idea is to shred the cabbage and steam it with onion, a little bit of salt, and maybe some other seasoning, and just boil the potato until they're soft and serve it just like that. Finished product. This is just the cabbage, shredded, steamed, and potatoes. I kind of, that's actually my full life plate. I haven't done mine yet. Day number three. As you can see, cabbage and potato in the black plate. And soup. You can have either cabbage and potato together as a meal uh, you can have the soup as a meal or you can have both but the whole point is you can't divert from cabbage potato and celery day number three we can feel the withdrawal of sugar we have constant headaches but that's a hump we just have to get over for this trial diet to see if it actually works this is day number four wife for life have decided to bake the potatoes yes. and potatoes were baked with just salt pepper and a little seasoning and that's steamed cabbage <laughs> so the credit that i have to give this one is it's it doesn't look as boring as what we've been having for the last three days no. <laughs> so there you go mm -hmm. 
This is day number five. Wife for life add boil the potatoes and mash them along with some roasted what you call these cubes? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And shredded cabbage as normal. So there you go. That's the potatoes in the oven. That's the mash. That's the shredded cabbage. So day number five, two days to go. Day number six. And all we've done today is just soup. So as you can see, celery and potato. And I've got a vegetable bouillon in it. And I also put a teaspoon of olive oil so that's day number six dinner earlier today we had some food from yesterday and for tomorrow which is day number seven it's just going to be a repeat of boiled potatoes and shredded cabbage that's pretty much it so woohoo we've pretty much done it Okay, so we're gonna discuss the pros and cons of this diet. Our favorite part. Okay, favorite part of it. Favorite part. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, I wouldn't say there's a favorite part. Um, mm. It's a diet, mm. and a diet is a sacrifice. You know, if it was not a sacrifice, everybody and anybody exactly. would have done it. Exactly. So, the pros and cons mm. to the cabbage and potato mm. diet is this. The pros is, or I would say pro, because I only can think of one. <laughs> and the only pro that I think of it, you can eat cabbage and potato or cabbage and potato soup mm. or a combination of both yeah. as much as you want per day. Right. That's the only plus. Yes. Um, it's not like you have to eat a set portion in the yeah. morning and the afternoon. Even. So pretty much you can eat cabbage and potato throughout the whole day. Because I think the first day we had that potato soup with a bit of celery in it and, um, and we put celery, onions and potato in the soup and we only made that and we ate that throughout the day. We were so hungry, we probably ate it about four times, four bowls of soup each. The con is, yeah. as much as you can eat or drink soup throughout the whole day, mm. the con, which I'm sure is transparent to you guys, yeah. is you quickly get sick and tired Definitely. of the same taste yeah. in your right. mouth <laughs> on your taste buds. Yeah. So as much as you can eat, as much as you want, the side effect to that is you will quickly get sick and tired of right, eating exactly. cabbage and potato. Yeah. I would, I don't think there is any pro for me to be honest. <laughs> okay. that wasn't because I struggled a bit more than, uh, than Hobby did, you know. By day three, uh, we started to have headaches. Yeah, that was a kind of, uh, yeah, you that know, was a kind we, of both of us. Started. The way I saw the headaches was more like when a airplane faces mm. turbulence. Right. Um, you can either turn back mm. or you can either ride through it exactly. until you hit the smooth path. So yeah. I think the headaches was more like our body calling, say, feed me, feed yeah. me, give me sugar, because give me... Because you're cutting out the sugar, you're cutting out fat, and the body does need all those essential... Um, well, the body, the body craves it. Yeah. You know, but what what I discovered, not she didn't discover it. <laughs> I discovered it. What I discovered was if you if you bear it, if you ride it through, <laughs> yeah. Um, you your body kind of realized that you're in charge, and you're not yeah. giving into it, and the body, <clears throat> excuse me, somehow stopped craving it. Mm. Yeah, your body does get used to it after after a while. Exactly. You know? And um, it's kind of like says, oh, okay, this is where you're going, so right. uh, let's carry on. Let's carry on. Yeah. yeah, that's the pros and cons. Well, let's give some, some actual numbers because we, we have some numbers. As you guys saw, when we started out on January 2nd, that was our first weigh-in. Yes. Um, you guys yeah. saw that we were respectively... What was I on January 2nd? Um, 
206.2 and yeah. you were? 187.2. Okay, so <laughs> did we or didn't we lose the weight? Last night at about midnight, yep. so technically this morning, we decided to step on the scale. Yeah! Check it out. <laughs> Moment of truth. Here we go. That's for me, and for you, one eighty point two. Okay. So we did it. We did it. Yeah. We lost what well, we got on we, paper. We lost a total of fifteen pounds, pounds together. together. But that's the total, yeah. you know. <laughs> As you can see, I lost eight pounds, yeah. you know, and one for life. Lost seven. Life seven, which is not good, which is not bad, I should not say. <laughs> you know, it's not bad because what that says is actually you lost a pound per day. Per day. You know, and that's that's not bad. Yeah. Um, so I'm happy with that. After that, however, we have to keep it real with you guys. Yeah. So yes. we're a slight deviation. Because yeah. I was at work, I was doing a nine hour shift and I had this very severe headache. So I says to hubby, I text him and I says, my headache is really bad. I've got five hours to go at work. She consulted and with me. Yeah. Yes, I did. <laughs> and I says, um, what if I don't have sugar, but have natural sugar, which is like a tangerine. So I tried to eat, to eat the tangerine. And because the thing is, as much yeah. as we're dieting and, you know, I was feeling the effects of it, yeah. but, you know, maybe I believe, you know, you know your own body. I believe that I could actually deal with it. Exactly. But I, I don't know her, her pain, pain threshold. threshold so, you understand? Yeah. So when she told me, I thought, you know what, it's a good experiment, but I don't want it to be a yeah. health risk. So I said right. to her, go ahead and get some natural sugars. Yeah. So over about three days three not days, not yeah. consecutively she skipped a few days mm. she had um two tangerines yeah and some grapes yeah although it didn't tape it didn't fully taper off the headache i still felt it like here at the front but it wasn't so painful like migraine is the painful so uh, whether it helped or not i don't know so what what we would recommend you know, we would recommend that you guys who are interested in losing weight try this. Yeah. But be mindful of the side effects that we experience. Right. Which are severe, severe headaches. Yeah. And like I say, the the pro is you can eat and drink as much Happy as you, you know, you but yeah. you will get sick and tired of it. Exactly. You know? I wouldn't recommend doing it more than a week. I wouldn't because it's a crash diet. It's yes. labeled as a crash diet. Any other question you guys have yeah. that we did not cover, <laughs> feel free to ask because exactly. you know we can now claim that we know something about yes. the cabbage and potato diet. The thing is, <laughs> like, like for all diets, because you've been doing it for a whole week of eating yeah. these plain food that, that just tastes like <laughs> It, it tastes like water as a substance, yeah, exactly. you know, as soon as the diet is finished, yeah. you know, we like, recommend that <laughs> you should gradually yeah. take on sugary or fat exactly. food. And um, yeah, hope you yeah. guys enjoy it. Let us know if you're going to try it, but yeah. without a doubt, <laughs> cabbage and potato diet yeah, works. It works. <laughs> Until next time. Ciao for now. Ciao for now. <laughs>